Hi YouTube, Uber Lady Charlotte here. And I was laying here because I'm getting ready to, to go to sleep. I'm sleepy. But I thought I'd tell you guys another short story. Um, I was talking to my sister earlier tonight and my middle sister. And we were just kind of going back over our childhood and stuff. And uh, we talked about this one particular incident. And um, I said, do you remember... Well, I ain't going to start it out like that, but that's how I started out with her. We used to live on a farm, and, you know, you had certain rules of the farm with the animals. You know, like, you, you don't, you know, you don't want to get in there and play with the pigs, because pigs will eat you. They'll bite you, and they'll eat you. All right, so, and they'll trample you, so you don't get in the pig pen and play with them. Um, you don't mess with the hen and play with her biddies. Or her little chicks, cause she'll chase you and peck you. Stop going down in the um the pasture, Kim, and trying to show the bull and uh, pet the cow. You know her name was Pet though, P E T. You know your outfits. I have to tell you about that story. Trying to show them my tennis outfits. That was a terrible thing. So anyway, so there were certain rules on the farm. All right. So. My mom said that we can go down to Carla's house. Carla was a teenager. She was might have been, Carla might have been 16. And I was 8 and my sister was 6, my middle sister. And so we were walking up the street to go to the pit. The pit was a giant hole in the ground. To us it looked like a big giant hole in the ground. But it was really a place where bulldozers had gone and dug out all this red dirt. So it looked like a big crater. All right. So we were going to walk up there and, and, um, Carla was going to let everybody take turns on her horse. Carla was a mean girl. She was a mean white girl. But, you know, we ain't had nobody on our street to play with, so we just kind of let her bully us all around. And I think she has emotional issues, but we didn't know no better. Because sometimes she was nice to us. Other times she stayed kicking our ass and holding our mouth, her hand over our mouth, so we couldn't scream. But, you know, anyway. So we get down, We well, we're walking up the street, and I'm, it's... It's the ki the kids are in front of my sister and I. Carla is in front of me because she's got the horse by the bridle. But in front of her is what I meant to say. There were a group of kids. And then there was me. And then well, there was a horse. And there was me. And then there was my sister. So we're walking up the street. And I got to make sure my sister stays out the street because there's a narrow road. And cars come down the street, up back and forth, up and down the street. So I want to make sure that she don't get hit by a car because she's only six. And my mama had this thing of, uh, if something happened to your sister, I'm going to beat your ass. Or I'm going to kill you. If something happened to your sister and she get killed, I'm going to kill you. So it was going to be a double funeral. So I had to look out for her extra, extra. Cause my sister was silly. She stayed in the most trouble. Well, we're walking up the street. And then I hear, uh. So I walk a little further. And I'm like, what is that? Because I heard the soft sound of something hitting the ground. And just a little, uh. I turn around. And I see my sister crawling out the ditch. So I said, what you doing in that ditch? You stay out of that ditch, you're going to get me in trouble. I'm going to get a whooping. My sister, okay. Walk a little further. Again, I'm in front of her. She's behind me. The horse is in front of me. And then Carla is in front of the horse. And the kids are in front of Carla. Then I hear, uh, and I hear that soft sound again. I turn around and look, my sister coming out the ditch again. I mean, this is the ditch on the side of the road with briars in it and them concrete pipes and trash and bottles and, and poison ivy, whatever. The ditch was nasty. It wasn't clean. So I'm like, what are you doing? Stay out of that ditch. You're going to get me in trouble. And we're going to have to go home. And Carla ain't going to let us ride her horse. She said, okay, Kim. Walking a little further, walking a little further. Then I hear, uh. I turn around. She crawling out the ditch again. So I say, okay. I say, okay, okay. This has got to change because you're going to get me killed. Um, I say, you walk in front of me. And I'm going to walk behind you. Because I got to I gotta keep you from falling in the ditch. I'm thinking my sister fainting or she's just jumping over in the ditch. I don't know. Whichever one it was. Um. Uh, so I'm like, I'm going to walk behind you so I can keep you from falling in the ditch. So we're walking on up the street. Then I saw why my sister was in the ditch. 
she was pulling hairs out of the horse's tail and the horse was kicking her in the ditch and she crawled back out the ditch and she'd do it again so i saw her pull a hair out the horse's tail he kicked in the ditch and i'm like oh and then i just took her home and you're crazy tail we just going home but we're not gonna get to ride car on the horse and then mama gonna whoop me and kill me and, and, and nothing ain't gonna happen to you so we went home but that's what was happening <laughs>